Good day, guys, and welcome to the first ever 4K vlog. I hope it works out. I hope I have the camera set up properly. It does say 4K on the side. I haven't done any test footage and looked at it yet. Uh, I have no idea how I'm gonna edit this. Uh, it is possible I might have to. It's like shaking kind of a little bit. Yeah, it's got I a know, stabilizer got in it. Stabilizer, man. I've got to figure out how to. Uh, it's the it's my car. It's very shaky, and then this shakes. That sucks. Well, isn't there a napkin supposed to be under there? No, I should, yeah, I put that one. Yeah, that's supposed to be there, but I think it just makes it shake. And this thing's just so wobbly. Maybe if I do that, it's all right. A little bit better, maybe. Anyway, as you can see, we're uh, early morning vlog. I sent out my vlog at 7 a.m., so I edited it last night, watched the Stranger Things, and uh, then went to bed. Uh, so, and then I had it scheduled to go at 7 o'clock this morning. I woke up at like 6 after, jumped on the computer when I woke up, checked to see if it's up and running, shared it on my Facebook. I appreciate you guys sharing it on your Facebook, Twitter, Whatever you can, that always helps me. But uh, several people from Australia said, all right, early vlog. They get to watch it before they go to bed. So 7 a.m. here in Australia or New Zealand, it's like 11 o'clock a.m. So that was very cool of you guys to tell me that. Let me just do, do this corner. I'm gonna have to find a, a better mount for this car now because it changed cameras. We're just seeing how it works. Right now, we couldn't get this to hook up to the uh, live view thingy, so there's gotta be a faster way. Again, I gotta get used to all this new equipment. Anyway, so driving Ben to school. Ben, say hi. Hi. Uh, today is a crazy busy day. I'm starting off the morning with my oatmeal. Uh, I did get your uh, email or your message about using soy milk and stuff. But I'm worried about calcium, and I know I'll be drinking milk other times of the day, but uh, I wouldn't mind trying the, the almond stuff. My wife does almond breeze every morning with her milk, I mean with her cereal, so uh, I'll try that tomorrow. So I did the, I didn't read your email until after I ate my breakfast, so I did my porridge with a little bit of brown sugar and a, a nice heaping teaspoon of flaxseed plus the milk. And, uh, orange juice, my omega-3 pills, and that was it. So right now, uh, I'm gonna go work out, or drop Ben off, go work out, and I gotta get back home, edit, upload, uh, cook and review, and then uh, and then get over to Egg Smart, do a food review, get back home, download that, and then go down to uh, lunch, or sorry, dinner with my buddy Dean. We haven't hung out in, in like ages, so you get to see two of my friends in two days, which is kind of cool. Well, three, because you saw Paul on Monday, Steve on Tuesday, Dean tonight. Those are my three, uh, my three best friends there, guys. So, uh, yeah, three of my best friends in a row. Nice. Sometimes we'll get them all together. Yeah, Dean, Dean, uh, sorry, Steve wants to be uh, in one of the cooking reviews. Yeah? Yeah. That'd be really cool. That would be That'd cool. Be really cool. All right, guys, so let's go. Okay, this day is gonna be all testing. So this is our first test of this camera outside. It's a little windy, as you can see by the flags. Another thing I can't do is I can't see what I'm shooting right now. So I think I think it's on wide. Let me check. If it's not on wide, I don't know what angle this thing's set to. Oh boy. This whole time I'm thinking that it's on wide. It should be set to wide first and then you'd have to set it to something else different. But uh, the Coke trucks here, breakfast of champions. So again, I'd like to hear all your feedback on anything and everything that I do with this camera today. Um, I'm definitely probably gonna have to get some type of a mic and then kind of mount it to the side somehow. Maybe make up a special little rig for it. But then and now it becomes larger. That's what I really liked about the Canon Vixia Mini X. 
I don't have to worry about anything. It always sounded great. Oh boy. I had a good sound suppression. Some kids early morning hockey. Those kids aren't gonna be unhealthy at all. All right, let's work out. Okay, it is on wide. 4K. Ooh, zoom, <laughs> zoom. Uh, I've got my the app here. This little. Uh, cool. And I can uh, do all my adjustments too. And I can turn the camera on and off with my phone. Sweet. Two things. This camera that I'm holding is down one bar. It's got like three or four bars left. So it's kind of spooking me out how much battery power this thing's got. I'm gonna try and use it until it runs out so I kind of know. And uh, my phone is only at 18%. I forgot to plug it in. Just checking out the backlight feature. So those are bright windows behind me. That's doing a really good job. So that's what it's like. I got it hooked up to my phone, which I think is better than the wrist action cami thing. Cool. All done my ride, 30 minutes. It says I burned almost 300 calories, so uh, I'm not sure about that, but feels like it. <laughs> I'm dizzy. Oops. You can probably tell by the sweat in my brow. How hard I cycled there. Wow. It's all in my eyes. So I'm just gonna do a few laps to cool my muscles down and to evaporate some of the sweat. <laughs> All done, it's quarter after nine. Actually, you know what? I should get back on the bike for half an hour. Totally forgot. Back to the bike, people, back to the bike. All done my ride. I cycled way harder on this one and actually burned 300 calories before I hit the 30 minute mark. It was like 29.50 or something. And uh, so, Pretty happy about that, I guess, because I did my bike ride earlier. It was all nice and warmed up, did my weight training, strength training, then went back to the bike. I guess my energy level was there and my heart was already beating faster. So I didn't start from like a cold run. Anyway, let's cool off. On my way home, all done the workout, feel good. The endorphins are kicking in. I don't look forward to seeing how big these files are, being 4K and all. That'll be another interesting turn of events for my computer system. All of a sudden I'm storing 4K video files. Uh, I might drop back down, <laughs> depending on how's it, how, it, how it goes. Casey Neistat got away with it for his umpteen hundreds of logs on 
1080 and they were fine for me so let's try it see how it works and then uh, I'll still use this camera but let's go Okay, I am back home as you can see. Uh, just it is quarter to one. I gotta really move now because uh, Dean called me and uh, he said he'll be at Boston Pizza by four o'clock. And I told Dan that I'd be at his restaurant by 2 30 just to be there ahead of time to shoot some cutaway shots and then shoot it from 3 to 3 30. Because that's when the restaurant's at its most dead. Um, I think next time I'm gonna, when I befriend a, a restaurant owner, I'm gonna say, you know what? If you have any clientele, any patrons uh, of the of the establishment, uh, if they would want to be in the video, uh, because you know, after watching some of the man versus food and stuff like that, he like interviews people that, that go there all the time and eat specific things. And, and it'd be kind of fun to interview them real quick and, and make the video a little bit longer and, and just get some feedback of the people that actually use that restaurant or, or go to that restaurant and eat there. So right now I'm trying to put together the cook and review. It's like at 24 minutes long. I'm going to try and take out like another minute. I'm going to go through the fine tooth comb and, and trim some of the fat off that food uh recipe video and uh then we'll get our asses moving because I, I have to shave shower uh and then I'll probably go just straight from there straight down to where where dean is and uh yeah i'm not sure if we're going to move i think we're just going to eat dinner and, and chat for a couple hours so you ready let's go <laughs> Another thought, this battery sucks. Uh, it was dying on the way home from the workout. So I only used it in the car going there when I was at the at the facility and on the way home. And I think I only shot about 13 minutes worth of footage. So it's probably because it's in 4K. I'm going to get as much feedback from you guys as possible, whether you like the 4K or not. Uh, and if you like this crazy wide angle lens, I might back it off once and um, if you guys and then maybe tomorrow I'll shoot the whole day in HD. So 1980 by sorry, 1920 by 1080. Some people are like, what is 4K? And it's four represents 4000 pixels. So just to give you a heads up, this TV can do 4000 pixels of data. So uh, of pixels, sorry. Uh, so if I take the card out of this and put on that TV and you watch the footage, it would look absolutely amazing. Uh, but if this was just a 1080 pic, uh, uh, TV, so it's only 1920 pixels by 1080 pixels. And then uh, I watch, let's say, an old television show from an old DVD, the quality would look like crap. So... Now that we have 4K, I think we even have 5K now, but most cameras are at least up to 4K. So when you watch footage from this on a television like that, it is going to look spectacular. Okay, we are good to go. I have to head up to Alcona. Let's see if I can do this whole jacket thing whilst vlogging. Done! Um, so I launched the video, it was 2.30. And uh, I'm like, I'm pretty sure we're just past our anniversary for Cook and Review. And it turns out today is actually the anniversary. How did that, how did that work? I have no idea how that worked out. Wow. So I'm like just trying to find the first video. And it was the pizza one. Homemade pizza. That was the first video we made. And then the habanero after that. And it was actually released... March 2016. Sam's reminding me that I have to walk him before I go anywhere. So Sam is correct. 
we, uh, I got all my stuff. I got my drone. I've got a tripod in the car. I should bring my smaller one. Just so I don't have to like totally take over. I think I have it in here. All right, found my mini tripod. I also have this tripod. I'm gonna use this camera today, try it out. And uh, so just to bring the level of the restaurant review videos to that next level. Um, depends on how well this turns out. I might go to this too. But I bought that camera to increase the production value and the credibility of the show. So I'm gonna use that. I'm bringing that just in case there's a table close by I can throw that on, it'll be a little bit easier. This is my backup. And then I also have the big one if, I, if this is not working the way I want it to work. I'm bringing my laptop so when I get to Boston Pizza, if Dean's not there, then I can go back online quickly, respond to some of the comments uh, for today's cook and review. Car's all packed with all my stuff. Let's get going. Unfortunately, it's raining, so I can't get my drone shots. Can't do my exterior shot that I do out here just to announce where I am. I, I gotta get in. Uh, we're all set up. Unfortunately, it's pouring rain outside, and I really want to do a good job for, for Dan. So I have to um, come back either tomorrow or Friday. The music's right there. I have to come back either tomorrow or Friday and shoot the exterior shot of me outside and then uh, the drone shots, because I need those. I want to do a good job. On my way down to see Dean, unfortunately it's uh, quarter after four. I really wanted to get there for four because he said he was going to get there for four. Uh, in the past, <laughs> Dean's never got there before five. I always got there earlier and then started having a beer before he got there, ordered an appetizer so when he walked in there was beer and appetizers for him and uh but this time uh, 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 he got there at four and i'm stuck up north doing my review i thought i for sure when, when i left dan's uh egg smart restaurant as i was walking to my car and i sat in there realizing how late i am i'm like dude i gotta stop freaking planning these things so tight because it's kind of stressed my day out a little bit and uh, oh boo hoo. No big deal. I'll just get there a little later than I was supposed to. Uh, it would have been nice if he got there at five just for the ease of me getting down there right now. Um, and I thought it was only going to take me about a half an hour to shoot the video with Dan. But uh, Dan and I, when we start talking, we don't shut up. And it takes forever to get through our conversations, which is great. Like, it goes both ways, both of our conversation. We both have really interesting things to say. Well, he does. I don't have anything interesting to say at all. I said, I suck and, you know, I should just quit. All right. So, off to uh, Boston Pizza in Newmarket, Ontario. Let's go. Made it down to Newmarket and it's pouring rain. My hair is gonna get wet. <laughs> I texted you, nice hat. Be like, where is he? Check it out. That looks pretty awesome. How are you, sir? Good, you? All right, man. Ooh, nice. My turn. <laughs> okay, Dean and I are finished our dinner. Uh, we had the Thai bites yeah. uh, as an appetizer, and then we went with the uh, the mediator. No, the meteor. Meteor. Meteor pizza, but it's like meat-ear. 
and uh, we took out one of the meats, which was the ground beef, and replaced it with mushrooms, which is a total recommend if you uh, come to Boston Pizza. Did you like that? You liked it that way? It was delish. Do you remember the, having it with the ground beef? Yeah. Did you remember it being icky? Uh, I can it's just too take beefy. it or leave it. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. Dean likes to eat egg. <laughs> uh, the Thai bites are good. Uh, and we just had a beer each, and uh, that's it. Yeah. We finished. It was a good night. It's uh, almost uh, 6 o'clock. Ben, uh, sorry, uh, Dean has to go to bed. Uh, his wife called. He's got to go. That's, yeah. it. that's, that's how it goes sometimes. Married life. That's right. Your life. <laughs> happy wife, happy life. Exactly. And, he, and, he, and Dean's taking the pizza home. Uh, Dean treated me, so next time it's my turn. <laughs> cool? Absolutely.